Football is a vital part of being a student at Voorhees. Whether you're a player, a spectator, or a coach, you know the importance of the sport in the school. This year, a longtime coach for the team is resigning from his position. That person is Mr. Angstad. My first impression, I thought he was a real, real tough coach, real uh, hard guy that was going to be a tough guy to play for. But as I got to know him, I realized once you know how he coaches and his style, the game becomes a lot more fun. It's just a great time overall, and he's a really good coach. I thought he was intimidating, you know, a little scared. I was a freshman. I didn't know what to think of him because, like, I wasn't very close with him. But now that I'm a senior and, like, I play for him, it's, he's awesome. I love him. I guess the first thing I noticed was uh, his energy. The thing about Coach Angstad is that his enthusiasm and energy is contagious. People see how, how interested he is and how excited he gets and they feed off that. Well, I thought he was a cool coach. Freshman year to now, you can see how he, like, he grew with us. He said that there's going to be winners and losers. No matter what side of the coin you're on, you can always take that skill and apply it to real life. So obviously we lost. The main lesson was that we tried our absolute hardest and left it all on the field. So if you do that in life, you, should, you could be successful most of the time. Responsibility. You just got to be responsible for yourself. When you do something wrong, you got to stick up for yourself and admit that you were wrong. Well, he's taught me a bunch of stuff on the field and off the field. He taught me how to drive a car. I learned more about coaching from Coach Angstad than anybody because he knew how to coach kids of today. There's a big difference in the way athletics are coached now than they were when I was in high school. He was really even ahead of his time in terms of how to handle kids. He was very progressive in that and I really learned how to get through to kids in a different way. Just his uh, personality and he's a really outgoing coach and he puts a lot of heart into the games. So that's what makes him such a good coach and such a good person. If you ever need something, he's like, he's always there for you. He's just a good person to talk to. I don't know if people can live up to uh, Coach Angstad's reputation as a defensive coordinator because he was, just knew exactly what to do at all times. He is one of the most unselfish head coaches you'll ever find. There, there's, there's no ego there. Coach Angstad lets his coaches coach and there's no finger pointing when it's you know good and bad. It's we did this, you know, we accomplished this together or we didn't get this done together. From VHS TV, I'm John, signing out. Catch!